pictures. In this video, I'm just going to show you how you can create a sort of manga zoom effects line effect in Illustrator. I'm using Illustrator CC 2014. I'm going to use the Polar Grid tool. So first thing to do, first thing I'm actually going to do before I do anything is actually create a quick width profile. I'm just going to just create this one. So I'm just going to draw a line, just draw a line like that using the line tool, line segment tool. And just go down to the width tool and just drag that out. So you want to fairly thick this end. And what I'm going to do, I'm just going to just reduce it down to a very, very actually zero at that bit. So you've likewise at that end as well. So it's just zero. Okay, so you've just got that thick there. And of course, you could do lots of variations. You could sort of have different. Uh, short shapes, wobbles and designs within that. Okay, so once you've actually done that, just go over here and add to profiles. So click OK. Right, just going to get rid of that. Next thing to do is go over to the Polar Grid tool. And that's just underneath the line segment tool. So Polar Grid tool, double click on that. I'm going to set to zero for this and 60. So I want lots and lots of lines coming out from a central point. So Next thing, OK, and just going to drag that out there. OK, so you've got this design now. And what I want to do now is just go over to, I'm just going to add a, a bit of strokes. You can actually see the design. Three, and going to ungroup, object, ungroup. Because what I want to do is I want to get rid of this circle. And the circle is just a just a basic circle, so I can get rid of that. And now you've just got this lovely sort of lines all equally spaced in a circle. Now I can use the width profile that I just created earlier. So and there's of course other ones just here. You can actually just use those, just click through that. You can see diff variant things, but I'm just gonna go for the one like that, or the one at the bottom, the one that I just created. And of course I can increase the size, so 10. And you've got a nice sort of high impact burst, which you can, of course, now add to any of your cartoons, comic book designs. And of course, you can create many different variants. And you can, of course, remove the central bit. Quick, easy way of removing the central bit, of course, visually anyway. She just create a white center. So you have that back to null. Right. And there you have it. You've got a very quick, high impact zoom effects line design for manga comics hope you found this of interest thank you much